Hello and welcome to the Modeling for All project. In this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a simple agent based model using the Behaviour Composer software. The first thing to do is go to the website that says modelingforall.org. If you type that into um, any browser you'll come to this web page and the first thing to do is go over to this box on the right where it says try the software and click. This will take you to a new tab or web page and I'm just going to increase the size of the text so it's easier to read. And you'll see that it launches into a menu area called Help, which is written here at the top. I'm going to move straight over to the menu that says Composer. This is where you will compile the building blocks, which we call microbehaviors, that will constitute your model. So the first thing I want to do is change this um, agent or prototype to be renamed to fish. So I'm going to create agents which are fish. Now to give these um, fish um, behaviors I'm going to go over to the menu that says resources which is written here at the top and click and this takes me to a large collection of um, what we call micro behaviors and in here we see a section or menu area called appearance. If I click here it will take me to the section of this web page and you see here are a number of micro behaviors so it's set shape, set color, set patch size and so on. I'm going to click on the set shape link here and this takes me to <coughs> a web page where I see at the top it says I change my appearance that's a basic description of what this micro behavior does here there's a button and here there is some net logo co code. I won't go into what this does, how this works at the moment. Just read it off. It says set shape and it sets shape to fish. Down here you can see the other shapes that you could choose. But I'm going to leave it as fish. Now the next thing to do is go to the button and click and select the first menu item that says add to prototype. So if I click that takes me back to the composer area or the composer menu and here it's asking me to drop this micro behavior by clicking onto fish. So I do that and I put the set shape um, micro behavior onto the agent or prototype called fish. So let's see what this does. If I now click run it says go to your models applet page. We won't, again we won't worry about what this means we'll just click here and here we see the models being created. Um, now if I go to this button here where it says setup, if you click there, I see at the center of the simulation is a small fish pointing upwards. Okay. If I close this page, um, the next thing I want to do is allow this fish to move because if fish can't move then oxygen can't get past their gills and they quickly die. So if I go back to the full library, the tab here that says full library, I'll go to the section that says movement and I'm going to allow this fish to move forward randomly. So I click again, here it says do every one unit of time in the simulation and it says go forward. So every one unit of time in the simulation I go forward. If I click onto here, again, add to prototype from the menu, drop this prototype onto the fish prototype or agent, and then click run again, click into here, and then I press setup. I see my <coughs> I see my single small fish. And now I want the simulator simulation to run, so I click go, so that the simulation time units will step forward. So when I pre press go, the fish <coughs> starts moving one step forward each time unit. So you hear you, in the top left hand corner of this box, you see it. In, you will see it incrementing by one. So I'll stop that, close this browser page and I'll start adding some more micro behaviors. So again I go to the menu and the next thing I want to do is make these fish 
bigger. And in the appearance section, I see a micro behavior called set size. I again, click here, click on, and here I don't want it to be set size two, I want them to be larger. So I'm going to set size four. And I just, again, click in this box and replace two with four. And then I click on the button here, add to prototype, drop it onto the fish. And now I should, should see a larger fish moving forward one unit each time series step. So I'll stop that. And last thing I want to do is create a uh, school of fish so this single fish is less lonely. So I go to the reproduction section of the microbehavior library, and here I see an agent um, microbehavior called add copies. So I can see that this add copies microbehavior will add nine more um, fish to my simulation. So I'll click add copies, add to prototype, drop it onto fish, click run again, and then I'll set up, and there I see ten fish, which is my original fish, plus nine extra fish. And then when I press go, you see the fish swimming around randomly. So that's it for this video tutorial. I just wanted to show you how to create the basic actions involving creating a simple agent-based model using the Behaviour Composer software.